Hey Penguins, Dad's Head here, and today I have got something different as I am not on Club Penguin. That's right, today I want to show you guys how you can create some awesome text like this one on your screen right now. Do you want your name like this and have it look like the Club Penguin font? Well, I'm going to show you how to do that. So first off, you need to get yourself a photo editing software. I use Photoshop, however, this costs money, but you can get a 30 day free trial. However, you can also download some free software, I believe there is paint.net or GIMP, but just a heads up, you cannot use MS Paint. You can't use Microsoft Paint for this to work. So the first thing you need to do is download the font. The font up here is Burbank Big Wide. I will leave a link in the description below on where you can get it and once you've installed that then you open up your photo editing software and what we've got to do is we'll just hide these examples you get a clean clean file and all you do is you type in your text so today I want to do my name and so we have it there and on Photoshop what you do is you go down to effects and you need to add a gradient overlay and so it adds one, you double click it and you change the color to a very light blue that's more of a purple, there we go, light blue and it's got white already and we click OK and we click OK on that one and that bit's done and then we click a tick on the drop shadow we're not going to change any of the shadow um, stuff, we'll leave it as it is and that's your first bit of text done. So your next thing is you would normally add a stroke onto it and then the color like blue. Whoops. There we go. But as you can see here, the shadow has disappeared. So what we have to do first is draw a small box behind the text make sure it is behind the text so you can't see it and we have to merge these two together um, first you have to actually rasterize the type to then be able to merge the layers this then means that it will create a stroke and you will see the shadow so let's change the color. There we go. And then we give the size. And as you can see, you can see the shadow, which is what we want. So you change it to about the size that you you want. Click OK. And then you're almost done. To add the final thing, you get another text box or shape box and make sure it's behind the text merge them and then we will add a drop shadow to that and there you go you are done that is your name completed and that looks like the text that Club Penguin uses a lot on their images so you can also do this with big block text like this and as it says hit that like button if you have enjoyed this video and I hope you find this tutorial useful it means that you guys can start making your own cool fonts for your graphics and stuff and make it look like club penguin stuff so that would be pretty cool I'd love to see your creations let me know what you think about this tutorial in the comments below I hope it was helpful do you want to see more things like this more tutorials club penguin related tutorials then comment below and let me know and I will see you guys in my next video bye